Welcome to part one of our game hacking workshop tutorials. In this part, I'll be going over how to use DNSpy to modify Unity games. For this demo, I'll be using Pinroot, which was actually developed by ACM Game Studio. So huge shout out to them. And right now I'm on the third level of the game where your goal is to destroy these wasp nests on the map. Unfortunately, the nests spawn wasps that launch projectiles that can kill you. So let's see what we can do to make this level a little bit easier. So we launch DNSpy and click File Open, then locate the C-Sharp Assembly.dll. This file contains the C-Sharp scripts that have been converted to assembly definitions, and DNSpy will decompile this assembly into more readable code that we can modify. So I'm going to expand these tabs and start looking for stuff that might pertain to the wasps. I found this class called Wasp Spawner, and I see that it has this function called Spawn Wasp. If we right-click and click Edit Method, we'll be able to modify the function definition. And reading the code, we can see that one of these cases in the switch statement will instantiate a game object wasp. So we can modify the switch statement so this basically never happens. Uh, then we save the module and then restart the game. All right, let's see if there are any more wasps. Well, it turns out there are. I don't think they're spawning from the nests anymore, but these things that fall next to the player. So let's look at DNSpy again and see if there's anything else we can modify. Okay, so I found this class called wasp bomb that has a spawn wasp function. Uh, let's try deleting this part and see if that gets rid of the problem. It looks like it did. The bombs drop, but there are no wasps that spawn. Uh, there are still vines that shoot out that can kill you though. So let's see if we can remove them. So I did a control F, which allowed me to search if the word vine was in any of the scripts. It appears in CJ boss class and examining the function, you'll see that there is a function called attack, which invokes drop bomb. Uh, there's a screeching sound that plays before the vines are shot out. And then this function shoot vines. So let's just delete this, save the module and restart the game. All right. And I think that did it. Uh, there are no longer wasp buying from nests or bombs. There are no vines that shoot out and kill you. So I think uh, that'll be it for this level. I uh, hope you found this helpful. Uh, next video, uh, my guy Ted will be going over how to use Cheat Engine to do some cool stuff. So uh, thanks for watching.